Jubilant Stories, unearthing the power of together. The village that I live in is probably a little bit untypical from the forest because I live in Brockwear, which are, a lot of the people that are coming there are incomers. Mm -hmm. But somehow or other, the whole ethos of community has rubbed off on all these incomers yes. and they've come together oh, yes. and oh, formed nice. an incredible community yes. there. So it's interesting actually. So it doesn't always just come from those that are traditionally yes. there, but something rubs off from here <laughs> onto those people. What sort of things happen right? within the community to oh, make it a tremendous community? tremendous amount of things in that particular community because it's got its own um, volunteer shop which is, um, mm. there is a, a, a manager, but the, the majority of people who work in the shop yeah. are volunteers. Mm. Mm. And it's a very isolated area. It could be, but because um, all the cottages are very disparate and scattered mm. across the hillsides, but this mm. gives it the whole community a focal point mm. and uh, brings people mm. together and then sort of generates other sort of community-centred activity. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. you know, it's it's not always just that it, it comes from those who mm -hmm. traditionally lived in mm -hmm. an area. It's Maybe there's a virus, a forest fire.